uh, I have a, a girlfriend of mine that has um, it. Uh, I'm going to say this incorrectly, but she has colitis and it's ulcer... Ulcerative colitis. Yes, yeah. that's what she has. Right. And so she's a great girl, very funny, very attractive girl. Mm -hmm. And she was telling me, she's like, not that it matters if someone's attractive or not when you've got a, an ordeal like this. Yeah. But she was like, I'm going to have to probably wear a colostomy bag at some point. Some patients have to do that, yeah. And, yeah. and, um, and so I just didn't know right. if it, I was telling her, I was like, well, you know what, when you do, right. we'll get you, we'll make some sort of designer bag. Yeah. We'll, we'll come out with something that is, right. makes it cool. Like let's make colitis cool. Yeah. Well, just by talking about it makes it a little bit easier to deal with, I think. But yeah, I think, uh, yeah, some people have to go, I know people that have that and it's just. In, in terms it sucks. of yeah, it, it would just suck. It would be sucks. tough. It it does, but you can also there's also solutions out there that that you can if you get together with other people that have it in the Crohn's and Colitis Foundation of like the Northwest chapter. There's like there's different kind of things you can do that you can support each other and and we have a luncheon every year. I do this thing called the Flight to Mars concert. Not to be promoting myself, but at any rate, they these are things that you can do that are solution oriented that I think can make you feel better about your life. Because I have it, and I know that when I find out other people have it, like your girlfriend, and how she deals with it, I need to I need to hear those things because that makes my life better. And in turn, the reciprocity of all that helps us find a solution to this thing. Have you, you ever know? Have you ever had somebody say to you, you know what? I've always loved you, and I love you more now that I know you have colitis. Uh, I've heard, yeah, I've heard people say, keep you know spreading the word you know, yeah. for sure because when I found it when I had it that's when I first got it found it I was 21 and I didn't know anybody that had it and now since I've been talking about it and doing you know this event or whatever I, I find more people that have it or relatives that have it or friends that have it and and they say just keep doing it because it makes us and, and I sure you know if it if it helps anything you know I'll, t I'll talk about it yeah um, it helps me final question um, do you, what was your code? I have another girlfriend. Like I have, a, yeah. It's just colitis. So it's colitis today. That's just the. the uh, you had a lot of girlfriends with it. Well, yeah. well, you know, whatever. Yeah. And and it, well, it's always great when girls are open about stuff like that. Yeah. Now I know guys don't feel that way, but yeah. for girls, it's cool when it's like you can. And so her code awesome. used to be like. Oh, to, to go. To yeah. go. Yeah, she would be like, she would, she would whisper, she could be like, my ass is gonna fall off. <laughs> and so, and it's like, I mean, we went to summer camp together as right. as teenagers and and so I always remember that it's like my ass is gonna fall off yeah. and so I just didn't know if you what was your code either in the band or like would it be I you know good question I want to use that one I love that one yeah That's funny it's like my ass is gonna fall off um, I, I'm that is my new code I'm gonna, <laughs> I'm, I'm gonna use that now back for band <laughs> stuff I just go I'm gonna, I gotta get I gotta use the bathroom right, right. now I gotta go right, right now and or I just go I yeah, off, but yeah, I'm you're not, like I don't have time to tell anybody. I don't. You, that's the thing. You don't really have time to go. The eagle has landed. <laughs> you know, like you've got to, you got to, you got to kind of <laughs> go for it.